So what does it actually mean to live minimalism? Other than just having a capsule wardrobe and getting rid of stuff. In my video today, in this video, I want to show you other areas of our daily life where and how to practice daily minimalism. Select what you put on your calendar. Open your agenda or your diary or your calendar and look at those things that you have written down. Are these things really things that you love doing? Do these things makes you happy or you hate them and they are just taking your time away if yes remove those things immediately because if you do not like doing these things there is no space for things like this there because probably these things are not important to you also think about your choices before you make them if someone for example asks you to do him a favor think first before you answer them if you, if you say no, it doesn't mean that you will never do it. You just feel that way at that moment. Do only things or wait for things that you are passionate about. Because only you decide how you spend your time. Not your habits, not your obligation. But it's only your choice. And with this point, I will come to my next point. Do not let your habits rule your life. Minimalism is also about being aware of what you are doing and where are you going actually. I know that sometimes it might be like really chill and relaxed to sit in the evening in front of the TV and eat dinner, but is it really what you want? Isn't it just a habit or just a routine? Instead of allowing your habits to talk to you and to rule your world, take the action. Do something that you really want. Also embrace different hobbies. Nowadays, many hobbies that we have are consumeristic and we need to buy a lot of supplies and equipment to do these hobbies. For example, if you want to do a craft training, we need to buy some fitness equipment or if you want to take photography we need to buy a camera and another stuff think through the things that you really enjoy and things that really makes you happy or you can make your fitness workout at home or you can instead of going to a fitness center you can just go jogging go to nature Find another alternative, but don't buy things. Also focus on connections and on the relationship. Stop running from one thing to another. Just take time. Just do one thing after another. If you want to connect with people, then go and connect with people. Switch off your phone, switch off the TV and go out there. Be present and spend the time with the one that you love. Talk to them, empathize, listen to them. Very, very important is also to be mindful of the impact of things. And these things should be things that have positive impact on you and are also important to you. From having a dinner with your friends or family, playing with kids or just going to nature but also it could be for example living low or zero waste lifestyle or finally quitting your stressful job every one of us see minimalism in a different way but on our personal minimalism journey we will pretty fast find out which things makes us happy and which things we allow to put on our calendar or things that we allow to have at home. Because practicing minimalism daily, minimalism means to have intentional life. And that is very, very important because only you are going to decide how you spend your time, how you spend and where does your energy goes 
with who you spend your time not someone else it's only you and it's all your choice how you want to lead your life i'm pretty sure that every one of us wants to lead a happy and peaceful life right so please if you have another tips how to practice daily minimalism please write them down in the comments if you want to know more on this topic and on this theme or if you want to know more about me you can read my blog or you can check my instagram where i am posting every single day and if you don't want to miss other video make sure you subscribe and um yeah if you like the video give it a thumbs up and i will be very very happy if i could see you very soon have a nice day and be good bye